We're traveling all over New England, and now we're making a stop in a very special town. This is Palmer, Massachusetts, located in between Springfield and Worcester, right off the Massachusetts Turnpike. And we're making a visit to Steaming Tender Restaurant. Oh boy, very special place. This is a 19th century Romanesque style building that at one time was actually a train station, a railroad depot. And we were actually located in between two major train lines that go right past this building. Our goal is to have people leave and want to tell their friends. It's incredible inside. It's listed on the National Register of Historic Places. It is a full restaurant and they have all kinds of events and special things that happen. <laughs> that is amazing. So we're going to check out this very special place in Palmer, Steaming Tender Restaurant. Join me. Hi Jim, welcome to the Steaming Tender Restaurant. Good Palmer, to meet you. Massachusetts. Good to meet you too. I hope you're hungry. Very. We're going to make to you today a uh, limoncello haddock, uh, which is our signature dish. That's yes. what you make it. Okay. All right. Then we're just going to sear that. This is breaded in clam fry. So I'm just going to add a little salt and a little pepper. And that will give it the nice flavor of the lemoncello infused into the haddock. And now we throw in our artichoke hearts, we throw in our sun-dried tomatoes, and then heavy cream. Here we go, chef. Gotta get some of that sauce in there. Sun-dried oh, yeah. tomato and of course, yep. that fresh haddock from Massachusetts. That's Here we go. Okay. <laughs> that is amazing. You know, what I really like is I, I feel like I should be grabbing a luggage, having a meal, and then hopping on the train. It still has that true, authentic feel, which is not always an easy thing to master, but you guys have done it beautifully. That is our goal. We want our customers to experience um, the building, um, the atmosphere, the trains. Um, it's more than just the food. I mean, the food is fantastic. When a train goes by, the whole dining room just takes on like a like a, a happiness. I can't explain it. Let's talk about the food we have in front of us here. What is that burger there? Our Brakeman burger. It is um, um, an eight ounce um, choice burger um, with a um, beer battered onion ring with our own um, cured bacon um, with Swiss cheese. And then this one here. Oh my God. Mac and cheese. Tell us about this one. This has some weight to it. That is our homemade lobster mac and cheese. Oh, that is our go-to dish here. We do all types of versions. We do the uh, lobster, which is our most popular. We do a scallop and bacon. We do fried barbecue chicken, um, buffalo chicken. And how about this big dish here too? What's that? That is our fried fisherman's platter. Um, we get all of our seafood fresh. Um, we're only open five days a week and we get our fish delivered uh, two days out of the five that we're open. So we ensure that we have the best quality um, seafood possible. Uh, I actually just love our scallops. They are just plump and delicious. What would you say to people that are watching right now who have yet to come to this incredible place here in Palmer? You need to check us out. Um, you aren't going to experience a restaurant like ours. Um, every person who enters is a guest and we make them feel comfortable. We, they're going to become, they're going to come and eat and be educated at the same time. Mm -hmm. um, they're going to witness trains passing by um, as you dine. Um, instead of, uh, we call it a train aquarium, right. instead of uh, seeing fish, you're going to see trains. <laughs> got the fantastic restaurant in the former train depot and then you've got this really cool car next to the tracks. Tell us about the history of this car. 
Well, this is from the um, 1909. It's a Osgood Bradley New Haven railroad car. Uh, we brought this in from Grafton, Massachusetts um, by uh, tractor trailer and cranes about uh, about eight years ago. So you do family reunions, private events, and is it open during the day too or it's specific to private pre-reserved events? Well, we keep it open um, as an exhibit basically to kind of add another element to um, our guest dining experience. And um, as you can see on the streets, we have railroad fans already there. They stay and uh, they stay in the area or they come in for the day and you know they're taking pictures of the trains yeah. and the activity and of course you know the historical elements that the train station offers as well. Hi Jim, I hope you enjoyed your experience here at the Steaming Tender. This was absolutely amazing and it exceeded my expectations. I heard so much about it but this place is really something very special here in Massachusetts and New England and I can see why People come from miles and miles around to visit this place. Not just those railroad enthusiasts, but people who like good food, good service, and step back in time a little bit too, right? Yeah, with the old world hospitality as well, so. Thanks for having us come. Thank you very much. We will be back. All right. I will be on my way. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. It's fantastic here in Palmer, Massachusetts at Steaming Tender Restaurant. It is truly amazing. That's my perspective, New England. What's yours? Come here to Palmer, Massachusetts between Springfield and Worcester and check it out. You will love this place. Yeah.